Xavier do it? How did he? Oh, this is an overused joke. No, I'm so sorry. How did Xavier become TikTok famous? All right, so to do that, we have to rewind the clock all the way back to VidCon a month and a half ago. All you think you're so cool cause you're TikTok famous now. Who brought you in this conversation? You're irrelevant, you're TikTok famous, come on now. I thought I was... Anyway, like I was saying, so let's rewind the clock all the way back to VidCon. These people, these famous TikTokers, like what, like, like who cares about famous TikTokers? So, at this point, I, I had only 800 followers and I was doing TikToks like this. Yeah. I walk around like gang. I had I had TikTok the first day it came out. But I didn't start actually posting until March. And I was doing good. I was posting a TikTok a day. YouTube can, I could only do so much. By the way, I love you guys. Don't ever think you are my heart and soul. Oh, let me say that with the cool glasses on. I'm sorry, that sounded so bad. You guys are my heart and soul. You guys mean everything to me. Y'all been with me through every single situation I'm in. I really do mean that. I learned like this doing this YouTube stuff alone because remember it's just me there's no one here and then Alexa please don't say my name Ooh. okay but yeah as I said like I, I quickly noticed like if I want to expand this app TikTok is like growing exponentially don't ask me to spell that Ooh. and I said to myself I need an app that I'm, I'm, I'm okay that could be okay with just being one person filming TikTok. So I saw TikTok and I said all these TikTokers doing these TikToks, filming these YouTube videos by themselves. Okay, they're growing. So I gave it a shot, but I still wasn't posting. And this was before VidCon. So, but then this up and comer TikTok. Bastion Bedeker blew up out of nowhere. Good news and some bad news. Which one you want to hear first? Uh, good news, I guess. Well, the good news is your mother passed away. How is that good news? I didn't say whose good news it was. How is he doing this? This is actually pretty cool. And so, and he was posting three TikToks today. Well, he still posts three TikToks today. And he has so many followers because he's actually talented. He knows what he's doing. So I said, okay, so what if it happens if I start posting three times a day? Now, this is before VidCon. So, at that time, I had like 300 TikTok followers, but then I came with this, I came with the idea of this TikTok right here. That's how I got my first couple followers, like 800, but then July 12th, we went to Victor. So, step number one, the procedure of getting TikTok famous. So, that's it, at Victor. Because I quickly, quickly, quickly learned that there wasn't a lot of YouTubers. It was TikToker takeover, as you see in all these clips. Uh, da, 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 I, I got a new life, you would hardly read. Uh, da, 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 I, I got a new And so I said to myself, I don't have a lot of followers. So, cause like part of the I wanted to, I wanted to make TikToks talk, like talk chit chat, but I have really bad, really, really, really bad social anxiety and it's like i couldn't talk to them because i was kind of too scared cash which i will get to in a second uh i'm at payton tiktok is still cover from tiktokers along with me seeing the dope race let's not forget about that that is an iconic moment you mean face to face finally finally <laughs> finally i know who you are man. i'm getting followers because remember it was a three-day event it was a three guys, it was a three day event. So that means everyone's just gonna come back the next day, the next day, the next day for VidCon. That's when I dropped the first video on my YouTube channel titled Meeting Famous TikTokers at VidCon. And that's when I met Cash. Now, I don't lie to y'all. I feel like my intelligence is like going down. That people who just make two second videos from just doing this has more clout than me. No one should have more clout than me. Me and him have a little bit of history. Not really, he knows me, kinda not really. But he viewed my profile. I'ma see if I can find it. If I can't find it, just know he viewed my profile. I'm too 
too scared to go up to him. So I had someone ask Cash to be film a TikTok with me. The same day, that same a couple minutes later, Josh Richards came. This could actually boost me. Not in like a clout type of way, but like, I'm here by myself. Cause remember, I went to VidCon by myself. Cause I don't have any friends. Make you wish you were dead. Every time she moves on, she So I said, okay, this is working. And then a couple people was all like, that guy was on a For You page yesterday. Cause remember, VidCon was a three day event. I was on a For You page so many times during that time span with me too scared to walk up to the TikTokers. And I said, okay, this is working. So I had like, I had 900 followers now. So the day one, we met Cash. Next day, that's them at the dope break. And we had like that lovely moment, you know, and I said, okay, so the next day, but then I saw cash again and I said, okay, maybe I can film. Yeah. My first TikTok was with cash. So I was like, I kind of like him as a, like a TikToker. It's like it's a cool person. Same with Josh Richards. If I wanted to cloud chase, I mean, I coulda, I coulda. But only approach people that actually genuinely think are cool people. For example, Cash, Josh, and other people. And so, yeah, so I did that. That's when me and Cash filmed that iconic TikTok at VidCon. Yep. And then I met the dude with the same name as me that same day. Ironically, have the same name, which is also crazy. My YouTube luck continues, but like, what's the chances of that? How's it going, Xavier? What's up? I've never <laughs> said. You know, it's 1.2, 1, 1,000, 1,200 followers. Okay, and I said, okay, this is working. But then I got scared because I wanted to hang out because everyone was going that same night after I saw the no breaks. By the way, that was amazing. I said, okay, this is working. So I went to the TikTok. I went to the TikTok at the party. That's when they were getting in the bus in this TikTok right here. I don't have any clout. We're all going in the TikTok at the party. And I said, I want to go. But then I said, okay, this is, this is decent. If I could get into that TikTok bus, I might be able to see even more TikTokers and make friends. Do you remember? I don't have any friends. So I said, okay, this is working. So that, the, the, the okay, so y'all remember this, right? You get in the thing. Um, I have no idea. Oh, where are you going? Well, how I snuck in a TikTok bus. I said, oh, we're, we're, we're here. There, I saw Lauren Gray. I saw, what's her name? What's her name? Sebastian Bale's girlfriend, I think. The Shea Frost, which is also a famous YouTuber, as you see right here. Hey, what's up, it's Shea Frost. Yo, what's up, it's your buddy Shea Frost. Thank you, Frost, please, bro. Thank you, bro. And I said, okay. I was surrounded by, so I don't know if I said this or not. This JT Casey and other famous TikToks, and me being a little TikToker with a thousand followers, being surrounded by a hundred thousand, a million, I'm like, bro, uh... Cause I have social anxiety, so it's like this. So, go have a party. Give my, I'm still those TikToks that I did with the film and other TikTokers, cause I was too scared to talk to them, was gaining rapidly. The cash TikTok I would did, I did, was gaining rapidly, and that got me my first initial followers. But then I come back home, and I'm like, a VidCon is over, and I don't want to be known as the guy that does this sound. So I need to do, I need to find some way to get my, the, another 1,000 followers or more followers. So I come up with this idea of continuing it along with coming up with my, with my new idea to gain followers on TikTok, become TikTok famous. So I see this idea. It's where I, I clone multiple, I clone two things. I clone two things. I get one thing and I clone the other one. With the cloning machine, as you see, Right here. Now, 
That is, that is rapidly growing. I literally, within the past two weeks, as I'm recording this right now, I've gained 10,000 followers in like a week and a half. Guess people like that content, so I, I kept doing I'm still doing it, and that's how I got the followers. Killing the game right now. So all in all, he inspired me to do TikTok. I you I went to VidCon because I want to be surrounded with people who do the same thing I do. And VidCon to this day, out of all the experiences, VidCon was a major thing for me. Like that was the best thing. Best thing of 2019 so far, VidCon. Because you know what happened at VidCon. But yeah, that was the best experiences. Best experience 2019 by far. Can you just stop saying TikTok? But yeah, Cash is cool. He was the first person I filmed my first TikTok with. So, thank you so much for watching. I got more videos coming. Like I said, if you want a shout out, all you have to subscribe, click the bell, and all you gotta do is comment anything you want. That's about your comment. Today's shout out goes to Big Paul. Game Master, Life of Alexa Rosario, Blake Seth. Thank you so much. You guys are awesome from TikTok. You guys from YouTube are my day ones. Don't ever think you're not. But yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching. We're going back to LA. Key notifications on. We I still got more bangers coming. This was more of a video like see me live stream. I live stream daily. But yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching. You guys are awesome. Thank you.